we go. And we probably miss a lot in that 10 seconds because both of them are already at 40%. <laughs> Stuff happens. Um, Stuff happens really quick. This is going to be a volatile matchup, not because of the characters, but because of the players. Oh, I tried to go for that up smash. That was a crazy spot dodge. So, Shin. Oh, oh you... man. Nice. Yeah, he teched the hell out of that. Surprised he didn't go for the back throw. Yeah. He didn't get the tech that time. That the because the hitbox on that is so big, I don't even think Shin is able to touch the stage. Nice. Catch is rolling. Those roll ins will work against you, man. Yep. Missed the ledge. Nice up throw. Still able to follow up afterwards though. Yeah. Oh man. That up here. <sighs> oh, that was crazy. That was sick. Okay, they finally found a TV to play Injustice on in the corner. That's good. Yeah. Still I was kind of like worried about them here. Oh, oh man. Yeah, Shin, Shin kind of running away with this now. He decided that he's not going to let Pride stop him from using Fox. What well, would have been a crazy fall with Smash if that did it? Wow. Got him. Yeah, he did. Yeah. This stage will end Fox once he gets grabbed. So, Shin doing a much better job than I've seen him before. He's kind of like trying to bait out rolls now. You know, does he just keep... Yeah. Yeah, he, he, just, he just he just looking to, to bait out his rolls. Mm -hmm. But he's doing a bad job of putting himself in the corner like that. Oh, had he gotten that, that would have been a game. Going for that forward smash. I oh. don't exactly know why. Shoot, wow. That was such an excellent read by uh, Holy Warrior trying to like reach in double jumps. Yeah. Wow. Pika. Oh, I thought he was going to go for it. Wow. I almost thought the up smash was already going to take it. The sneak attack. <laughs> yeah, he, he, he waiting on him so hard right now. Oh, he knew he was going to go for the grab. Surprise, Holy Warrior don't jump cancel grab yet. You won, two oh? Oh, okay. What was the score? Two oh? Okay. Yeah, yeah I gotta keep scores. Right. Yeah. Ouch. Shen will do that in your face. Uh, he'll just kind of like chance and wait on you. So, Shin playing the patient game a lot better than, um, than Holy Warrior. Fraud versus G. TV2. Oh, I gotta go. There you go. No, uh, Yeah. There you go. No, he don't do commentary. Fraud versus G. Okay, let's get back to this because you know we still doing what we do best, and that's bringing you proper commentary. Oh, try to go for that gimp on Shin, but Shin not having it. Shin playing a very patient game, catching you, catching him whenever he try to dash in. He punishing the hell out of him for it. Nice, excellent use of shine. Oh, battlefield it. Shin doing an excellent job though. Neutral on point. Waiting them out. Oh my god. <laughs> Didn't know what to do right there. I think forward smash maybe could have reached.
a Gimp. I see you come sneaking over here, so all right. Yeah. Right. yeah. No. <laughs> um, it was the summer before I left. Yeah. 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 I mean, the thing about it is, my school's actual cafeteria is shit, so I just go out to the like convenience store every day. And actually, the thing about Japan that's really convenient is that you can get really good food really quickly. Whereas, obviously, if you're in North America, if you're getting food fast, it's probably shit. So. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, God. He asking you all these questions on commentary, man. You gotta get to this. Always. You could ask him, you could ask him that. You know? Alright, nice. So we finally have Holy Warrior taking the lead off of Shin, which uh, Shin was actually outplaying him in the neutral, but Holy Warrior doing a much better job now of kind of like adapting and waiting him out now. So for people who don't know, aka me, explain to me this rise that Holy Warrior's been having, because apparently he's ranked number one. Uh, yeah, Holy Warrior's actually just been destroying everybody lately. He has a very janky play style, but he's starting to perfect some of the jank to a level where it's just annoying and really irritating to fight him. And that could happen. Um, he was actually really, really, really consistent coming out to tournaments, but the one, every one that he came out to, he won. Even the ones that Shin didn't show up to. And then like one or two, what Shin did show up to, he would beat him. So uh, that would happen. And Shin also has been losing to like some other random players. You would have like uh, Viper, who's just been on the rise, who has a winning record versus Shin, with, like 2-0. Um, 2-0 and a 3-1. And then you got the Wong, who actually next in line to just be unstoppable. Because he won the previous tournament. Okay, Shin playing a little, little smarter. Ah! The read. Yeah, he got him. Wow. Holy Warrior played <laughs> Like he, Holy Warrior picked up on like little things in neutral that people like to do versus him. And he just... He's just not allowing you to get away with that anymore. So you have to straight up run him over if you want to beat him. And that's not something you're going to get away with run if you're over? the type of... You don't yeah. think that a uh, camping strategy might work against him? No. The camping strategy is what actually allows him to win. See? Shin kind of taking his time, trying to bait something out of him. And he, t and he running away with it. Nice. Let's see if he... Uh, I thought he was going to go for the up throw, but he probably knew he was DIing for that. Nice. He's trying to go for the job up smash. Shin trying so hard to finish it off right now. I don't think this is a good stage because if Holy Warrior grabs him, that's a chain grab. Yeah. Do you know why Shin might have picked the stage? Uh, he probably picked the stage because he doesn't want him to have any platforms to run to. When he, when he forces him to use up B, because Pikachu has a little bit of lag once he, she, it hits the ground, um, he could just run in and up smash him. See? Little stuff like that. Looking to just not give him any room. Oh my god, the read. Is Holy Warrior known for the chain grab or not really? Uh, he's known for the chain grab versus certain people. I, I think a person like Shin would probably not be chain grabbed for too long by him. So. But it'll work like versus my Captain Falcon. He'll, he'll always go for like the grabs on me. But I think he's probably unsure if he can grab Shin or not. So yeah, you won't see something like that um, happening in this matchup. I think it's like a mindset thing. Oh my god, that would have been a philanthropist stock. <laughs> Given to all the little poor needy kids that need stocks. Oh, yeah. And now you pressuring him by the ledge. Nice use of shine by Shin, though, to cover him jumping up with that up air. Because that's that could deal death for Fox. Yeah, Shin is doing an excellent job of not even being gimped by Holy Warrior. Nice. Nope. Holy Warrior has to stop trying to put his Thunderbolt. Like every time when he throw him off, he'll try the Thunderbolt in the same spot. He needs to go forward with the Thunderbolt. That's the only way that he can actually even pull off that game punch in. Because he's Thunderbolting in the same place too much. 
Shin goes high, is it even possible for him to give him specifically off for the Thunderbolt or does he need to follow up? Uh, if Shin goes high, it'll still catch him. It's just the angle that the Thunderbolt comes from and how high Pikachu jumps. So Shin can only go so high and usually he does when he do, does the jump back. Now if Shin decides to jump forward and immediately forward beat, that won't work for him. That'd still put him in a bad position. Yeah, and Shin won 2-1. Very good stuff.